I've got a magnet and the tablet here, and I'm running the app called uh, Physics Toolbox Magnetic Field that measures the magnetic field in the X, Y, and Z directions. And I'm moving the magnet around to find out exactly where the sensor is in the device. And you can sort of tell by how strong the fields are uh, when you're getting closer to the sensor. And you'll notice that right as I passed over the lower left corner, about a centimeter in from each of the edge of the left corner, that the uh, app shuts down. And that is when where the sensor is located and too strong a magnetic field will cause the app to shut down at that point. We might postulate that the magnetic field of a dipole would be some power law relation. In other words, a constant over uh, uh, the distance raised to some power, and that's what we're going to test. Now we're going to use the mag magnetic field app. We can set the number of data points and the distance that we're going to start the magnet from, which is seven centimeters from the center of the magnet, and also which axis we're going to be measuring, which is the x-axis of the magnetic field. Now we start recording data, and, a, and that records it into a spreadsheet, and we move one centimeter away from the sensor each time and pause for about four seconds to get a, a reading. Now I had put in that I was going to take 10 data points, but in fact I took 12. So when we go back to the app, so that's the next thing is to stop the recording of data and go back to the app. And we can change the number of data points to 12 because that's actually how many were taken. Then we hit Analyze and it comes up with a spreadsheet. And the spreadsheet has the step functions, uh, the magnetic field at each interval, one centimeter away. In order to get some more information from the data, what we've done is uh, linearize the uh, data by taking a logarithm of both sides. So if we now plot the log of the magnetic field versus the log of the distance, uh, we should get a straight line. And that is indeed what we find is that we, uh, when we plot this, this is the data downloaded from the spreadsheet that's generated by the app and we see that it's a pretty good fit to a straight line. The coefficients are given at the top. From the coefficients we see that uh, B, the power, is actually 3.3 according to the data. The theory, if you calculate the magnitude of a dipole along its axis, uh, should give a 1 over r cubed uh, relation, so it sh the answer should be 3, and we got 3.3. And then the other number is the magnitude of the magnetic field at a distance of 7 centimeters from the probe.